How you doing folks? Mike Pugh, Cloud Explorer from Hub Pages and Cloud News. Here we go with a very cool tutorial for Windows 8. Um, the question for a lot of people may be how do I customize my Windows 8 or Windows 8 Pro desktop? Now I utilize Object Dock and I brought you to the website. It's a stardock.com website but if you see the URL or the web address up here, slash products slash object doc. I found that obviously from Google. I typed object doc in Google and then you, you're going to find eventually it's going to bring you to the star doc web location. So you want the official object doc star doc web location to get this customization of a really cool toolbar. This is how the toolbar looks if you follow my mouse see my mouse and this button here I'm gonna show you how powerful it works and how cool it is so that way you don't have to worry about going to the bottom left corner of the screen bringing this up all the time or even pressing the Windows logo key which allows you to go back and forth like that I did it really fast so if you want the download here it is free download this is the paid paid download but I use the free one and it works well for Windows 8. So let me minimize and bring you back to my desktop. This is pretty much how my Windows 8 desktop looks like. It's very clear. All I have is a recycling bin right here. Okay, and that's a huge question for some people because usually you're going to see loads of icons on your Windows desktop, whether it's Windows XP, Windows Vista, or Windows 7 and now Windows 8 if you choose to make the upgrade so I want to show you where the object dock can be placed it can either be placed in the bottom here on the left here on the right here or on the top here as you see this is how the object dock comes out and it's really handy now say I wanted to get to those handy dandy icons right these are icons here they're fast icons it gets you to where you want to go you got time recycling bin weather which schedules and shows you the whole forecast five-day forecast if you click on it double click it it'll go to the web location for accuweather.com which is really unique so let's go back minimize that um, Windows Explorer this is just a folder just like this search here they're both the same folder I just have it set up that way so it'll just get you instantaneously to to your my documents stuff like that um, Skype this will open up Skype Windows Media Player Windows WordPad and now we have the internet Google Chrome and this is the upgrade to Mozilla Firefox that's a little throw in little bonus plus for y'all uh, Mozilla Firefox has this new thing called Aurora so if you want to get that just go to mozillafirefox.com check it out and you'll get Aurora uh, it's the newest de uh, beta test for Mozilla Firefox now we have start menu here goes the start menu this is going to be just like pressing the Windows logo so you just left click it with your mouse button and it switches right over. Now you can go back here and click this tile that says desktop to go back or you can uh, depress the Windows logo key on your keyboard if you don't have a touch screen. And pretty much I'm going to show you in the next videos how to do all this. Over here I detailed and customized my actual toolbar. That's why you don't see it at the bottom. I put it on the left side because you know you're gonna go up here on the top with Windows 8 to get to your apps and you're gonna go here on the bottom left corner on the bottom to use this you know access to your start menu which is your metro menu on Windows 8 every now and then um, the very next video is gonna be the part two of this video this is just an intro to object dock and how it can benefit for you on your Windows 8 desktop and then the next video is gonna show the details of how to how to customize this toolbar so that way you can have it the way you want it to look it starts out with nothing on it pretty much on Windows 8 so stay tuned subscribe comment etc peace